This next tip is probably the one that I personally use the most. It's the Alt Tab, or as Microsoft employees initially called it, it's the cool switch. Now this is a left-handed shortcut, meaning you have to use your left hand to get the, the most out of it. Here's what you do. You hold down the Alt key with your left thumb, and then simultaneously you tap the Tab key with your left pointer finger. So when I start tapping this key, I can see all the different programs that I have running right now. And I could, as soon as I let go with my thumb, I'm going to go to the program that I select. So here's a, let's say this is a lesson I'm working on and I'm doing some uh, web research on this topic. I can alt tab and go between those. Now here's a, a cool thing about this. As soon as you establish one switch, one tap switches you back to where you came from. So I just came from my browser, so if I do an alt tab, it goes back to my word processor. Alt tab takes me back to my browser, and it'll switch back and forth between those two. Now at any time, I can hold down the alt, and I can tab, 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 until I get to whatever it is that I want to go to. But the cool switch is right back to the program where I, where I came from. Now, just a little added bonus on this tip. If you're in a browser, you can use Control Tab, as I have in, on my slide here, Control Tab to go from tab to tab to tab on your browser. Now you can click them with your mouse, but if you're typing, your hands are already on the keyboard, this is a, a slick little way to switch to a different tab.